Now that these um, items are all available online, we've got a much greater asset in terms of what we can use to pull in for teaching and learning. We use a lot of the archive materials for prompts for learning in terms of helping students to think about what we can learn from the past to inform the future. The other option we have is that we can mix and match different pieces of the archives together because they're online and we couldn't have seen that before without actually going directly to the archives themselves. So because it's open and available to us, it just means we have more flexibility in terms of designing learning situations.